Hi, I'm Subpop Zero, and then today we're going to be using the Fatebringer. Fatebringer is a hand cannon from the uh, Vault of Glass Raid. Uh, the role I am currently going to use in this video is Hammer Forge Rifling, Acrodized Round, Killing Winds, Opening Shot with a Range Masterwork. And as you can see, that this range is fucking crazy. It's almost as comparable to Ace of Spades with better stability handling and reload speed. Uh, I did get other rolls that are pretty okay, but I definitely want to get better rolls of this hand cannon. Um, speaking of which, let's go to light.gg. If I had to choose like my personal best god roll, full bore, accurized rounds, rewind rounds, and then kill clip. But firefly is also pretty good too. So let's go ahead and jump into PvP. I am going to be using top tree gunslinger and with a seven serif shotgun. And a sword, but I don't think I'm really going to be trying to use the sword. Alright, let's get into PvP and see what we could do. Rumble. You're on your own. Every kill, every death is yours. Alright, right out the gate. Getting shot, one shot, might die here. Just sit here. I was just gonna sit and wait for me. You know. Okay, let's get that guy. It's like this dude is boom. Nope, do not ape me. That's gonna be coming through over here. Yep. Hunters Damn. like you blaze a path for the rest of us. Should have been a little bit closer to that gunfight, but we got a trade. Looks like power is up. Okay. Over here. This guy's got lost word. Just go ahead and dodge reload this. So close to death. I love it. Yeah, want to stop that guy from getting that AFK kill. At least me get it if anyone. Place that sword ammo. Two for one. This guy got an ape. Nope. Gotta rotate over, see if we can catch anyone off guard, get anyone one. Clean that guy up. Ooh. That guy was smart for pushing wide like that. Should have went back instead of trying to challenge. That's my fault. Definitely not in range of this. Damn. It's the one problem with 140s and is the range on them is not very great compared to 120. So that 120, that guy definitely would have been easier to kill. Double down. Okay, let's pick the sword ammo up. Five minutes. Just waste it. Not trying to get people to have it. Damn. I was not full health. Gonna put a shot with uh hand cannon before trying to shotgun him. It's like we are doing okay. You're 
almost there. I'm getting a nice three taps. The the kind of like max range roll I have on this is really helping on this map to kind of keep my damage. Oof, those are bad shots on my end. That guy should not have peeked out like that. Let's tag this guy, get this health regeneration to stop. Aw, oh, that guy's sitting in a rift. Oh, he got both of us? Damn, I thought I killed that guy. Alright. We are... Damn. Did someone leave? I thought rumble matches were six. Why is it every time I play rumble, there's always like only four of us, three of us. Let's throw that there. Kind of act as a trigger. Actually, this guy is going to be doing that. No. So many supers going off right now. Oh my. I activated Golden Gun and that guy did not want to peek me. Which is understandable. Because Golden Gun can out kill his. The Warlock's super. I forget what it's called. The freezing one. If I'm at range. And I don't get frozen. Yeah. It's like that guy had explosion rounds on his? Let's get this last final kill. Missed that jump. Man, the steel kills are insane right now. Damn. Wasn't winning that up close fight versus a sword. I cannot get this last kill to save my life. There we go. First, are you happy? You killed everyone. The victory was yours, and yours alone. Not bad. You know, we should probably. I'm gonna do one more rumble game just to kind of see that map was not that great for it, but. You're on your own. Every kill, every death is yours. All right, second game. Looks like this started with four people. This guy's really gonna try and aim. That's gonna get a free easy kill. No, I cut a dead slide. Oh, I hate getting dead slides in this game. Okay, looks like we got one more person. Pretty confident to take that guy out because he can't use a primary. 
that's one thing I noticed is that a lot of people that play Rumble that pretty much only use shotguns can't really use a primary. The only reason they won is just because Rumble is just a series of 1v1s where you have to try to kill the person as fast as you can. So it makes sense to use like specials like snipers and shotties. At the same time though, Rumble's such a good way to like learn how to win 1v1s. Alright bro, are you actually gonna like... Rumble's such a good way to like learn how to use primaries like hand cannons, ARs, pulse rifles, cause there, it's just a lot of 1v1 engagements. And people that play just around shotguns or like one particular easy weapon just really don't really see improvement. I used to love Rumble because Rumble was like one of the game game modes like I would use to get better at Destiny. Five minutes. Oh no. Unfortunately, just not a lot of people choose to, you know, they'd rather get the easy one, which is understandable. Damn, I suppose those shots. I had so many opportunities for kills there and I missed them. Looks like these guys are starting to catch up. Definitely need to start winning engagements and stop wasting time trying to play ring around the rosy with someone who doesn't want to push. If they don't want to push, then I'm not going to fight them. No point sitting there for 20 minutes. Guys behind the tree. Okay, we were able to get that kill before dying. my shotgun on them. You've lost the lead. Three minutes. You're in second. Just control this middle. Definitely would have won that if he would have kept the primary out, but whatever. These guys definitely like to play their lives. I'll give them credit, which is what they should do. What's up, Ron? No shotgun? Yup. Guys, definitely gonna be catching up with that super, so we gotta play it carefully. Let's get back in mid. This guy is running away. It's fine. Let's see if we can get a damage. I missed all those shots. Let's 
just dodge reload that because I don't want to waste time. Definitely want to be pushing this though. Looks like this guy might be cleaning up. One minute left. You're leading. Nearly there. Down. Fight on and claim victory. Sky under me probably is. Look. Thirty seconds left. You're leading. Hold fast. Oh, I should have made lead. Damn. Okay, I don't want to activate golden gun. I might activate golden gun just so I can secure the win here. It's all or nothing. Okay, let's do it. Oh, I couldn't see that guy. Oh, well, we won. You killed everyone. Would have liked to get the 20, but these guys are definitely playing a little bit more passive, playing lives, which is fine. Like I said, it's what they should do is play their lives. All right, so, Fadebringer. I'm going to have to give this gun... Uh, honestly, probably a 7. 7 or 8 out of 10. It's a good hand cannon. It's a 140, so it's not currently meta, but it's still pretty solid. Um, I, I don't know. Even with a god roll of, like, you know, kill clip in here or rewind round or something, I don't feel like this gun would be that great for something like Trials. Maybe it will be. I don't know. There definitely are better hand cannons right now. I think out of the 140s, this is definitely top tier, though. Would it replace something like Ace of Spades? Probably not. But it's definitely a good alternative option as a legendary hand cannon. So yeah, I would probably have to say 8. I'll give it out of 10. Definitely an 8 out of 10. It's good. There's probably better options and probably options that have more unique roles. To fit someone else's play style. But other than that. Thank you for watching. Uh, catch you next time.